Hey guys, it's Jalen. Welcome or welcome back. I'm here today to share with you probably a late update for Partners in Cream. This is a project that was created by Steph Lyons and Delin over at Outward Processing, and it's all about using our cream or liquid products. I typically have five items that I'm working on at a time in this project. I don't have anything to roll out this month, so I'm thinking I may roll something new in. I haven't even picked out that item yet, so it may be a last minute addition. But anyway, let me share with you the items I am working on and how well I'm doing on them. The first item I'm working on is by Mally. It's the Shadow Stick Extra in the shade Shimmering Mauve. I do want to finish this. I didn't have as much progress in this as I would have expected, but I did last update this on the 20th of July. So I only have about three weeks worth of use. But still, it's less than I would have thought. So there's the shade. And there it is. I share this out on my lid. So that's what that looks like. And then I usually put a like glitter glue on top and then apply my, my lid colors. <laughs> anyway, still working on this. And that's been in since the beginning of the year. Next up from It Cosmetics, I have the Your Skin But Better CC Color Correcting Full Coverage Cream in the shade 50. 50. Light. What is 50? light so it's this one here and this is my progress now i don't know if there was a shade like a line here in the middle if there was it rubbed off but that's how much is left so i'm pretty excited i don't know if I'll, i'm you know i'm going to focus on getting this finished by the next update because i would love to have this as an empty this is a lovely foundation i'm wearing it today i really do enjoy it but i've had it forever as you can tell it needs to go. Next from Cover FX, I have this click enhance enhance click stick thing in the shade Bubbly. So it's this little deluxe size sample. I keep forgetting to mark this on my book. So I'm just going to throw a picture of what this one looked like last month. And that's how much is left. And I use this as my illuminator before I put on foundation. So I typically will, there's the shade, I typically will just like get this all over my face and then rub it in before I put on foundation, after I put on primer. So anyway, this I want to finish. I don't think I'll have it done by the next update. It's going to be in here for a little while, but I'm fine with that because I love would love to get this out of my collection. Next from Kosas, I have the Color and Light Cream Duo in 8th Muse High Intensity. So it's this one here. I want to hit pan in one of these shades. Now, this is quickly getting to be a bit too dark for me, especially the blush, but really both. I feel like I'm close on the highlighter. I feel like I'm really close on the highlighter. So anyway, yeah, it's just, it's getting to be too dark. I really don't, I don't love the cream blush in this. I feel like it's a little bit challenging to work with. So yeah, there it is. It's pretty, you have to be really careful. And you know, now that I think about it, something I may do moving forward, and I, did, I don't know why I'm just not thinking about this, is to actually mix these two shades to get a good blush shade. So I'm just gonna see what this looks like. Yeah, that's much easier to wear. So I think I may do that moving forward because it's just so much, it's so hard to blend this shade out on my skin tone, even though I'm tan, still tan. I don't know, it's just, it's not the easiest shade to work with for my skin tone. So I think that's what I'm gonna do moving forward. And the last item I rolled in was a lip liner. This is from Jordana. It's the Easy Liner for Lips in Rock and Rose. And here is the shade. I want to finish this eventually this year. And I don't have a ton of progress on it. I am wearing it today, just a little bit to line my lips, but there we go, there's the shade. So not a ton of progress, but some. Some is better than none, and that's how much is left in here. So plenty of product. Okay, so let me go digging and find another item to roll in. All right, I'm going to roll in a lip product to finish. Now, this is by Nude Sticks, and it is the, I think it's the Gel Color Lip and Cheek Balm in the shade Pulse. 
So this is all that's left in here. Now this was like a deluxe size sample. I love this color so much. But I, I, I just bought a backup of this during Ulta's 21 Days of Beauty. No. Lips, li <laughs> International Lipstick Day. Or week. It was like a week. This is beautiful. And that's how much is left. But I need to, I need to finish it because I have to now have a backup and I'm really sorry for my nails. I tried something last night and it did not work. They're like still not officially dry. They just, I, I need to declutter the nail polishes I was using. Anyway, this I want to finish. So that's what I'm rolling in. I will go ahead and mark that in my book right after I'm done filming. So that is going to be it for this update. I am hopeful that I will have pan on that Kosas duo. That would be ideal. And I maybe I'll have this finished. That's my goal is to have pan and finish for next update. So that is going to be it. Thank you guys so much for watching. Hopefully you are doing well and staying safe. Please hit that subscribe button and I will see y'all next time. Bye. Ugh. Why? Okay, bye.